First, DBS says it did not see a spike in requests from customers for ATM card replacement. This comes a day after the bank announced that it had been, it had been hit by another round of unauthorized ATM withdrawals, this time in Singapore. On Sunday, $23,000 was stolen from 17 customers' accounts. 24-year-old Godric Tia received an SMS from DBS Bank on Monday morning. He was told his ATM card has been deactivated, but the bank didn't give a reason why. The bank just said that it was deactivated and it will give me like a waiver to change the replacement card. The bank should explain and should make a personal call to the consumers. I think it's only responsible. They delayed for four days before releasing it to the public. It's the second card skimming incident in two months involving DBS customers. DBS customers we spoke to were surprised that the bank's ATMs have been hit again. They should do uh, their, their part on, on this, uh, all these loopholes, uh, I mean, as in, because so that they will win back uh, our trust for them. With regards to any system, you know, nothing is perfect. And uh, as long as the bank that I'm dealing with, uh, you know, when anything uh, negative happens, right, and uh, they are proactive about fine-tuning it, then I think it'll be okay. Yeah, I will change my pin first, okay? And then if, let's say, uh, if this thing happen again and again, and then more people actually affected, I might consider to change another bank. The latest incident is not a new scheming operation, but a continuation of the one that began in November last year. Clearly, the fraudsters have not given up, even though new security measures have been put in place. DBS says the new security measures like the SMS alert service may have helped to contain fraudulent withdrawals at its ATMs. An SMS alert is triggered for withdrawals which are above a certain threshold set by the customer. Security experts believe the extent of the skimming operation could be bigger than what the bank estimated. The bank has actually identified that the, uh, the, the, the information was being skimmed in November. Uh, however, we feel that uh, it probably is uh, earlier than that, probably in September or October, the information has been skimmed from a lot of customers. It's just that the, uh, the, the group of these uh, people has not actually made use of the information to go to the banks to draw any cash out. The bank has advised customers to change their ATM pin to lower the risk of unauthorized withdrawals. Well, we managed to speak to one victim of the latest ATM fraud case, and he said he lost $2,000. Marcus Young called the bank when he received a message saying the sum had been withdrawn from an ATM in Boon Lay. Mr. Young lodged a police report upon discovering the fraud. He said he's not been to Bugis for a while, where DBS ATMs were found to have been compromised in a card-skimming scam in December. It's within 24 hours, la, they have uh, credited the 2000 to my account. And somebody called me to say that the money has been put back into my account. So I'm just wondering la, where, how, and you know, a lot of questions that uh, how did it happen, where, um, and how, how is it that somebody could just, uh, you know, uh, have my car to withdraw the money.